Mary Claire King grew up in Chicago, Illinois. She became interested in science, specifically cancer, when her childhood best friend died of cancer at the age of 15. She studied mathematics at Carleton College in Northfield, Minnesota, and graduated in 1966 at the age of 20. Then she pursued a doctorate in statistics at UC Berkeley. She fell in love with genetics in a low-level genetics class and transferred to the genetics PhD program in 1967. She received her PhD in genetics in 1973 from UC Berkeley. I did not find any of Mary Claire's hobbies, but there was a movie made in 2013 about one of her discoveries. The movie is about how her and her team proved that certain breast cancers are caused by a specific gene and not environmental factors. Something that I admire about Mary Claire King is that she is involved with human rights while still researching and studying genetics. I identify with her because she is supportive of women in science and also supports ethnic and sexual minorities, which is very important. I also identify with Mary Claire because she is a researcher in the genetics field, which is what I want to do. A quote from Mary Claire King that I really admire is, We understand that working together transcends politics. It is possible to do beautiful, useful science together, even between countries that are in conflict. Mary Claire King is involved in medical genetics. She is focused on studying families and populations to identify genes responsible for complex human conditions. The most recent paper that Mary Claire King is an author on was published in September 2018 and is called Inherited Thrombocytopenia Associated with the Mutation of UDP Galactose for Epimerase. The study was done on a family with a history of thrombocytopenia, which is characterized by a low number of platelets in the blood, making blood clots unable to form. Whole exome sequencing, which is the sequencing of only protein coding genes, was performed on all available family members. A homozygous mutation on the chromosome 1 was found in all affected family members. In all unaffected family members, the mutation was heterozygous or absent. In 1975, Mary Claire discovered that 99% of amino acids in humans and chimpanzees are identical. In 1990, breast cancer was thought to be caused by environmental factors only, but Mary Claire discovered that the, the gene that causes some breast cancers, called BRCA1, which is on chromosome 17. She has also discovered a gene that is linked to deafness and mutations that cause schizophrenia. In 1984, she worked with the grandmothers of De Plaza de Mayo in Argentina to identify 59 missing children that were illegally adopted without their family's consent and return them to the biological families. Mary Claire is currently an American Cancer Society professor of medical genetics and a professor at the University of Washington. In 2016, she was awarded the National Medal of Science by Barack Obama for her 40 years of work in genome science. She continues to study the genetic causes of human disorders.